Just picked me up from the airport. I wanted it to be a surprise. Well, you succeeded. <laughs> so, how is my beautiful daughter? Yeah, that's one. Uh, she's on a usual weekend escapade. I don't know. Ever since she came back from London, it's been one party or another. See, you missed me a lot. Hey. I picked up some Victoria's Secret for you. <laughs> oh, you just want your started again. <laughs> what do you want me to do when I marry the most beautiful girl in the class? Am I not so bold? <laughs> years after bagging a first class degree from the university I was jobless I was a laughing stock among my peers even my family Mr. Victor gave me a job his heart was carved out of gold he was the messiah hmm. who will meet you at the point of your needs you can say that again he is so rest in peace <sighs> drunk after your father's burial. Me? Drunk? I haven't had a drink in a year. Stupid child. Mommy. 
Mommy, what have you left behind for me? Thank you very much, Arinze. What brings you here? Your husband's will. There's something I would like to show you. And I want the both of you to watch. My dear wife and daughter, if you're watching this, it means I'm already dead. I'm sorry I cannot be there the way you want me to. It is the way that God has designed this world for balance. I am willing some of my properties in Lagos and Uyo to my dear wife, Patricia Ekpenyo. I know it will never be enough to express my gratitude for you sticking through these years with me. I love you, my cupcake. I love you too, yeah. mommy. To my only child, Oyai, the apple of my eyes. You deserve the best out of life, and I hope you find that with my help. Therefore, I entrust the sum of $200,000 to Mr. Rinze for you and also the house that we live in, this house. Oh. Daddy, you're the best daddy in the whole world. I love you. But there's one condition. I've been observing you for some time and I've come to realize that I've made a grievous mistake. The mistake of spoiling your say. And my heart is heavy. It grieves me to see the kind of woman you have become. You have become a selfish, inconsiderate woman. You don't seem to care about anyone else but you. I want you to become a better person. Hence my decision that you get married to a promising young man. Or at least have children. Is this a joke? I want you to show unconditional love to someone else. Loving people as Christ loves us. I'm doing this out of love for you, and I hope that you understand that. Arisa, stop this thing now! It's not done yet, man. Just stop it! You better leave. But what has come over him? What kind of outrageous condition is that? Is, Arisa, is there any way we can overlook the condition? Maybe with a compensation? Yeah. I swore with my life. I mean, he's dead and buried. I don't know what you're afraid of. Will you shut up? I will not let you disrespect your father like that. We will see what we can do. We cannot do anything, no. Nothing can be done. What was the big deal about this? I mean, people care for opportunities like this. Don't mind her. Spoilt brat. So you, you intend to remain in my own husband's house? 
house. <laughs> this is not my house, mommy. He willed it to me. Oh, so he plans to live here and die here. Where in the world is it written? It is in the Constitution or in the Bible that a woman must, must marry or have children. Where? Genesis chapter 2 verse 24 says, A man will leave his father and his mother and will clinch to his wife. And both of them will become one flesh. What, which one are you remind me? A pastor or a lawyer? I'm just trying to enlighten you. I don't need your enlightenment! Mr. Arisa, you know what? Get out! Oh yeah, what is wrong with you? He's telling you the truth. I'm just sitting down there. It's okay. I said I'm, I'm leaving. It's all right. Um, I'll, I'll be on my way, man. I'll, I'll call you. All right, ma'am. Thank you. Oh, yeah. You know you lack manners. Look at the way you spoke to that man. Anyways, from today, you better start calling all your boyfriends, exes and presents. She didn't make the video. You know what? What we need to do right now is to find you a husband. Why don't you want to wear a fancy wedding ring? Put on a beautiful wedding dress and toss the flowers so the bridesmaids can kill themselves trying to get it. Hmm? Like, oh yeah, honestly, marriage is such a beautiful thing. I'll tell you the truth. Ever since Daly and I got married, it's like honeymoon every single day. Although things got a little more interesting after Junior because then I had to feed and then he cries in the night and all that drama. But sometimes I wonder who sucks more, Junior or his father? Yeah. So now the only option we have is to get you pregnant. Hmm? Oh, I forgot. Children are monsters from the pit of hell. Exactly! Oh God, do you listen to yourself? Do you know how many people visit different mountains in the world, praying and fasting for the fruit of the womb? Fruit, fruit of the womb? How about apple of the eyes? I mean, who, who gets married and have kids this well, apart from you? Who gets married and have kids these days? <laughs> Nobody! <sighs> My family is they're, they're, they're trying to sabotage me. Somebody's up to something. Welcome to Divine Adoption Agency. It's been over 30 minutes. Time is money. So sorry for keeping you waiting. Um. You are Mrs. Oya Epeyong, right? Yes. You want to adopt a baby, a newborn baby? Correct. You should be here with your husband. He's out of town. And when will he return? He's gone for a few weeks. Look, isn't me being married enough? You obviously can see my ring. Uh, Mrs. Oya. I will advise you visit again with your husband when he returns. How much do you want? We don't sell babies. 
my arm. We give them out for adoption. What's the bloody difference? They are to be nurtured, not bought like groceries. You know what? I don't think you know who I am. Because if you do, you'll be glad that I walked into this building in the first place. It's my time. We'll be expecting you and your husband. All the spoiled children that think they run the world. Seriously? You dated all these guys? Dated, not slept with all of them. Swear. Really? Well, anyway, let's get started. So, Wenga, <laughs> the hot guy that made you cry six years ago, like I remember it like it was yesterday. Whatever. Richard, uh, no psychopath. Thank God for therapy, otherwise I would have lost my friend. But he was such a romantic dog. He was divorced. Four times. But it wasn't his fault. Still too much baggage. Yeah. Stanley. <laughs> <laughs> he thought he was sleep trying to propose to me with a fake ring, thinking I would not notice. <laughs> Girl, he, he was just trying to impress you. Honestly, you would have given him a chance. I don't do broken. You are so mean. I know. Uh Oh dear. Uh, Wally. It's work. I need to go. I guess I have to leave you to finish off with your drama. Mm -hmm. Alright. Alright. Bye, honey. I'll see you. Take care. Take care of yourself. Richard, no, no. <laughs> oh. You, no. Do that, believe me. Only a fool will believe you. You said you loved me, but now you carry your two leg makeup knot. Later, you people will be shouting men as you come up and down. And now I get away, you don't call this line again. Wait, Chidi, wait, Chidi. Hi, Shagun. I'm fine. Are you okay? I do now? Is there no one on this good earth who is willing to get me pregnant? I can't afford to lose this money, not even in my dreams.
Madam, you've come to the right place. <laughs> uh, you are married? No, I'm not married. Ah, then you're divorced. Hell no. Oh, my bad, my bad. Uh, you should be a widow then. What's with all this interrogation? Madam, it's part of the procedure, you know? Uh, but why will a beautiful woman like you come to a spam bank when you can easily get anyone to help you do it, you know? Is this part of the procedure? Okay, anyway, I have uh, uh, these eligible donors with good records. I believe uh, one of them here can actually help you solve your problem. Is this all you have? Uh, you don't like any of the 20? Obviously, I'm the wrong place. Madam, hold on. I have a special list. I, I, I call them the Messi's and the Ronaldo's. They are sharpshooters. Just a drop of their semen. Ah, even a menu post egg can be fertilized. This is it. Clean records. Never been to hospital for any medication. This one. Ah, madam, I see you have a good taste. This guy is the number one on our list. Uh, yes, but it's just that you can only get it on pre-order. Where can I find him? Uh, madam, you, ha you have to wait a second. No, where can I find him? You are too suffocated to begin to want to double things illegally. Do you want money? I have to do a transfer. Money. Madam is sorry. Let me take it easy now. Hey, hey. Hey, my Only for bad day, girl. Can take it easy. Why my father so me go now? Only run. Only obey panabi to go go that's not me now. This is that village champion. He's just angry that I'm the only one that managed to enter university from this area. That's it. Hey, you don't know that some people don't like success of other people. You don't know that. Eh? That you know. And you should know peace. Don't worry your love me if I come out there. I beg you. I'm not doing it, sir. Do it now. Tomorrow, you know, go go follow that. Yeah, yeah, stupid, non ethical boy, go fight. You don't hear me so. You don't go follow and fight again. Come on, non ethical is not a word. Now you sad. Not with the English, where we, where we, you know, the time where I go to school. <laughs> Come on, Tani, yeah, oh. Tani. Good afternoon. Does Falari live here? What can I do for you? Nothing. I, I just want to see Falari. Hey, hey. Falari. Why you no tell me say somebody can come look for you? Make I prepare my lag bag and the way do for her. What's that? Ah, am I one more body? She your, she be your girlfriend? No. no. I'm here to see Falari because I need. to... Hey. Sorry, I'm on butter. Mama, I, eh? just, uh, she's my visitor. She's my friend from somewhere. I beg you. Eh, sure. I know how about you, she? I beg you, just give us. Just two minutes. No, 
Oh, sorry, please. Uh -huh, before I forget, don't follow me. If she need anything, eh, make you let me. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. My name is Uyai Ekbeong. I'm here to see you. I know why you're here. Great. Makes it a lot easier. So how do you do it? Because we're not having sex. <sighs> I beg you relax. You're never in my time. So kill this guy. I don't understand. Why didn't you just make payment at the office? Now you didn't have to come here. Everything you can't find for you. Well, I wanted to meet the father of my future child. And also, you know... Make some findings. If he, he. You don't see if I'm a if I'm a thug, Abby. Hey, you don't check on. How you see him? No. I just wanted to find out if you had any hereditary illnesses in your family, but good for you to jump into conclusions. I know, just talk about for beginning now. It's me. I won't do fine. I beg, I don't have any uh, hereditary illnesses. I don't have any. We are, we are okay. How does it feel being raised in such a depressing condition? What's in the wrong view? Thinking about the stress of me even locating this shack gives me a headache. And being beat up. So how does it feel being wretched and unacceptable? Yeah, no problem. I I'm, I'm, I'm no get money, Abby. So now why you call me wretched? I'm, I'm wretched, no problem. So now you can't find me. Why you leave that your uh, banana island mansion? Can't find uh, someone, so, somebody wretched for shark. Maybe you can't fertilize that your useless egg. So now you come this side. I beg you, get busy. Free me, Jolly. I close that door behind you. get to the top of your so-called special list. The Madam. biggest insult I've gotten in my life today came from that stupid boy. Madam, take it easy. We're sorry. We're sorry for the inconveniences. Madam, whatever happens, put it on me. I have, uh, I think I can help out. We have a better list. Hey, hey, hey. Hold your damn list and you can go to hell with it. I'm done here. Madam, Come on, Madam, please. Shabby places. How See? can I even get myself in this place? In <sighs> Why does this, this boy do... Pick up! I will kill this boy today. See, John Paul, waiting the wrong you. Why go give clients my address now? I don't want to follow our contract. I swear, I swear, if you say you know my friend, I'll for me to arrest you. Which kind of nonsense be that? Why go give that girl my address? Now one, now, now, now one useless poor brat. Oh, oh, I saw you did talk, so I did wrong to give my friend opportunity to make good money now, Abby. I swear, something. You said not I'll not be that kind of person now. Anyway, I don't call him my court. I'll not be that kind of person. If you like, no wise up. All day. I beg, I beg, guy, free me, free me, I beg. When are you bringing him over? Bring in who? Your boyfriend, of course. Who else will I be referring to? You know, you've been avoiding this topic for a week now. He traveled. When is he back? In six months. What? Six? You know we can't afford to wait that long. So you mean he should abandon his business just to come and see you? At once. That's not going to work. You know, that's the only thing your father 
asked you to do for him? Have you for once stopped to ask yourself what he will be thinking wherever he is? You can't keep sitting indoors. Will your dream man fall from the sky? I wish I could just go back to London and never return. Running away doesn't solve the problem. You know what? I've had enough of this. Get set, we're going out tonight. That doesn't exactly solve the problem either. Get set, 11 p.m. Well, I have to finish up at the office and ask dinner first. Wait. You need a man's permission to go to the bar. He is my husband, duh. Not just any man. 11 p.m. Get set. I don't care how you do it. How often have this been happening? It has never happened before. Never. This is the first time I noticed such with my daughter. We conducted a series of uh, blood tests and we discovered that uh, uh, the protein level has increased abnormally. Doctor, what exactly are you saying? Do the family have a history of uh, cancer? God forbid such. Cancer? Yes, Reject it. Dr. Sam, you're scaring me. <laughs> well, uh, we can do a series of text and I uh, suspect you go through it. O ovarian cancer? Yes, of course. Uh, no, the, do Dr. Sam, there must be a mix of. Be so. My is daughter is hale and a hearty. That is the result. Ovarian cancer, I thought it was common amongst women who are above 60. Uh, yes, it also affects uh, women of lesser age. I think you have to give it some time to conduct uh, ultrasound to ascertain if she has it or not. But that would be my approval. Does it, does it mean that I will not be able to conceive, assuming I have it? Not exactly. But the chances are getting slimmer. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God, please don't do this to me. Please but I have to, I have to, to cool down, cool down. We shall conduct all that test too. We shall conduct all that test in the future. This, 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 this cannot be true. It can't be true. Babe, I am so sorry. I will be 35 this year. And I don't have a serious man in my life. I brought this on myself. No, no, don't be so hard on yourself. None of this is your fault. And to think that I found children repulsive. Listen, everything will happen in God's time, okay? <laughs> Ovarian cancer. That's God's plan for me. You know what? Your life is most important right now. Everything will come at the right time, including a man. What do you usually be to me when I can't even conceive? I'm so sorry.
Oh yeah. Can you? More can you die only can you drink it? Can you? Oh, oh, oh. She's bad doing that. Any common tongue? Man, don't be long. Thomas, she la lo lo re la la. Eh, she's into dancing. Hmm. I'm not, I'm, I'm not finished yet. I'm not finished. Mm, what is it? Okay. I want you to be strong for the day ahead. Are you hearing me? Very good. With all this preparation, they must not say no. I know, Mama. Eh? Thank you. It's not possible. Go, say, say. say, thank you. Go and excel, my dear. Wait, 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 wait. Mommy, what's he late? Go and exam, my dear. Thank you. And you can me also quite thank you. Thank you, Ran Wunye. I mean, mommy, mommy. What's your calling here? Till it. Till it. See you. Oh, you work by long day. Oh, yeah. Did it? Did it? Did it? Bye bye. Can I see your boss, please? Mm -hmm. I'm talking to you now. Good morning. Is your boss around, please? I heard you loud and clear the first time. Keep coming here like you ever get a different response. <sighs> My boss doesn't want to see you. <sighs> At least call her I now. I never said that. <laughs> Good morning, ma'am. Come in. Five minutes. Interesting. This is absolutely brilliant. Thank you, Ma. Thank you. I'm actually happy I heard you out. Thank you, Ma. So I will schedule a meeting with my partners um, so you can drop your details with the receptionist. Okay? Thank you, Ma. Thank you or so much, Ma. You can drop them right here. Do you have your card? I do. I just, I just printed it today. All right. So prepare for your pitch next week. I will send you a mail when it's time. Okay, ma. Okay, ma. Thank you. You don't know what this means to me, ma. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome.
should I leave this one? No, it's fine. I have this. I can take this one. Okay. Thank you, Ma. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ma. Thank you for the opportunity, Ma. Thank you for the opportunity, Ma. Yes. I'm grateful, Ma. See, jump for a bag. No comes for my mood. Hello, Fulani. Hello, is this? Promise you won't hang up. Let me guess, Madam Banana Island. It's me, I. What do you want? Look, I don't have time for your drama today. I beg you. I beg you. Wait, please. I, I know I was rude the other day. You came to my house to call me a wretch. That, that, that one pass rude. I beg you. I'm sorry. I'll text you. So I adjourned all of my meetings, but now His Excellency won't arrive. Why? Traffic, maybe. Wait, who is this person we're meeting and why are you not letting me in on this? If I tell you now, it will lose the essence, so... Patience, my love. Patience. Patience. Oh, I can see him. Hey! Should I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come in. He's here. <sighs> Sorry, I'm late. There's traffic at the bus stop. It's okay. You're here. That's all that matters now. Oh, you, oh, you, I, what is the meaning of this? Relax. So, we're offering you 5 million naira, which is way better than the peanuts they pay at the sperm bank. Sperm what? Is that why you met I, this guy? I, I, I can explain. I thought you were smart. What? I, I think I should go. I'm, I'm sorry, man. I swear you regret this. I swear. I understand you're desperate to have a child, but going to a sperm bank for goodness sake. Why? Isn't that extreme? You don't tell me what is extreme if you've never walked in my shoes before. Can you please open up? Let's talk. At least hear me out. We are awaiting the I, 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 I beg you, leave this place. I beg you, don't try me. Don't try me. See, believe me, that wasn't a setup. Are you are you stalking me or something? What? No. Okay. Now yesterday they bought me, Abby. How did you know I knew that woman? She's my friend. I was took that low. Which can you just excuse me that? I beg. I believe you. Do you even know who, who you're talking to? Do you know who I am? Okay, who are you? No, who are you? Say if you are somebody, what do you define for you? Answer me now. You're not my type. Sure. I'm not your type, Abby. So come. I love your type. yourself, you know. Ah, <laughs> uh -uh. 
for Larry. Don't get yourself stressed up. Better one will come. Eh? Good one will come by the grace of God. Say amen now. How are you, my dear? She's yet to come out of her room. Or... I don't know what has gotten over her. When are you coming? Oh, yeah. Babe, open. It's me, Dorcas. Oh Listen, babe, I'm really sorry, okay? I'm sorry I ruined your meeting. It's just, he was at my office to pitch an idea. A really good one. So, I, I just wasn't expecting that, you know. And the funny thing is, the idea was really, really good. I was going to give him the job. It's just... Considering the situation of things, I don't know if you would still want it. Babe, I'm really sorry. Please open up. Babe, what are you doing to yourself? Heart attack. I don't want to talk to you or anybody. No, but you have to. I don't watch you keep acting like this. Why did you come here? Because I'm your friend. And what hurts you hurts me as well. There's no point. You know, time they'll take out my ovaries. Babe. It's just stage one. Huh? It's the first stage. Isn't that what the doctor said? Yeah, but what does that have to do with anything? Well, it means that only one of your ovaries are infected. Mm -hmm. So that means you still have chances of getting pregnant. All we have to do right now is to find you someone. Hmm? Yeah, but I'm a loser. Nobody wants a loser. Nobody wants me. What's that? Oh, yeah. You are not a loser and nobody's taking out your ovaries you will have your man and your child in my inheritance yes and your inheritance plus you will be the best mother to the most beautiful child in the world you're the best friend in the world is that a smile <laughs> okay so you know what we're going to do let's get you changed because i am about to introduce you to the most eligible bachelor in Lagos. Is he rich? The food, food was delicious. I had loads of oh, fun. Oh, wow. You can say that again. Pleasure is all mine, my lady. <laughs> I was just wondering. Yeah. The reason why you haven't found the one. Could it be because you're raising your bar too high? You know, I think you should ask the woman that can help but gravitate towards me. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think you are? Cupid? Cupid. Yes, I am Cupid. I guess you'll come to my house and we'll have a drink, have fun. You get to find out. My car is parked somewhere around. Oh, sounds awesome. Sure, lady. Let's go. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Are you sure? 
I'm fine. You know what? Let's just reschedule. Maybe for some other time. Come on. You already agreed. You just have to keep to your word. So what's what's all this? No, well, I'm, I'm not feeling too good. Look. Wait! Leave me alone! Let's... Let's... Let me... Hey! Leave me alone! Baby. What's... What's up? Stay down to now. Stay down to leave him. Enjoy, bro. Madam, I found this inside the camera and the washer. Stay down to now. Stay down to live on. What are you doing here? Ah, you forgot your wallet. I just wanted to say thank you. I don't know what I would have done if you hadn't showed up. <sighs> Maybe you should consider that the next time you decide to go and get drunk with a stranger. Come on, I was I didn't even have a drink. You're making this this thing hard for me. I can say thank you because it's the appropriate thing to do. See, I left my client at that restaurant to come and save you. Okay, that guy could have just, you could have just useless you. There's nothing you could have done about it. Thank you. I'm busy, I beg. Sorry. Is there any way I can make it up to you? Look, I didn't help you to get any favors, Miss Uyai. I'm okay, thank you. Then why did you do it? You could have looked the other way. As annoying as you are, I couldn't just stand by and watch you get hurt. Thank you. Um, I have to leave now. Thank you, too. That kiss. Did you feel anything? Just like that. 
That happened, you were 15, and I just bought you a laptop. Let's just say I'm happy today. You've been happy all week. There's so much to be thankful for. Hmm. Life is good. Okay. Um, is, does that mean that your mystery man is back from his trip? <laughs> Mommy, you already have a name for him, mystery man. Uh, well, since you decided to keep his name anonymous. Well, he's a private person. Okay, what's his name? Mommy, I don't have time for this. I have to go meet Doc as we're planning her son's birthday. I'm only asking for his name, not his house address. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah, if your man, your mystery man does not act right, I am going to find you a man. Time is not on your side, you know. Yeah, but the money is not running away now, is it? It's about your father, not the money, dummy. Bye, Mommy. Certainly, we'll go there when you get back. Oh, yes, yes, they have the best tea in Lagos. <laughs> I'm gonna get. <laughs> I, I miss you already. All right, love. I'll talk to you later. So, my friend is getting booed up. Booed up. Don't guess. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> so who is it? Yes. Um, is it the same guess. guy I hit you up with? Ah! Don't remind me of the worst date I've ever been on in my entire life. Listen, I'm sorry. I had no idea he had those tendencies. You are cancelled, by the way, so you know. Oh, <laughs> what? I'm apologizing again. Sorry now. She keep apologizing. That was a disaster. So who is it? Guess. Oh, please don't make me guess. You know, like, I'm a total failure when it comes to guessing. Oh, please, Doc, because you're so boring. Try. Okay. Um, Ugo Chupu? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. Okay, wrong try. <laughs> um, Rashid? That stalker. He loved you. He's obsessed. But you always like your men, like, mm. obsessed with you. He stalked me around. He was everywhere I turned, asking for a second chance. Mm -mm. What? Are, are, you, are you okay? Are you okay? What? What? Wait, what's going on?
So, is your mystery guy the father? Why does everybody keep calling him that? Well, are you going to tell me who it is? What? Please don't tell me it's that... that, that loser. Shh, you're not shouting. Huh? Why would I shout? Is that love you had to sleep with that, that low life, that non-entity, and now you're pregnant? Oh, you don't even know what you've done to yourself. He's not a non-entity. He's not a loser. He he has ambitions, you know. He, he has dreams. Dreams. That is all that will ever be. Like, I get it. I understand you desperately want a child, and I support you. But stopping that low? Fuckers, I don't like your tone. I don't care if you do. Because whoever this is, this is not my friend at all. Uh. Is Apa home? No, she's uh, at school. It's just us. Mommy's at the market. What's wrong? Uh -uh. Yeah, what's wrong? Talk to me now. I'm pregnant. That's fantastic. Why would you be sad about that? That's, that's, that's fantastic news. What's, what's wrong? Yeah, what's going on? What's this? This is the five million naira as promised. Look, we cannot continue to do this acting like, you know, this is real. We need to stop deceiving each other. This is not going to lead anywhere. It's, it's, we are from two different worlds. It's your friend Doka, Sabi. She's the one doing because what, this, this is not you now. I'm doing this because I love you. How are you? How is this love? How is this love? You can actually start up your business with that. Excuse. I don't need your money. Okay, look, I'm, I'm, I'm not just going to sell off my child like this. Like, what are you doing? We had that. I thought we had something special. No, we don't. When you're ready for me to sign another check for you, let me know. And, um... We had, don't do this, I beg you. I'm sorry. Oh yeah, hold on, hold on. and you think you can hide it from me, your mother. Mommy, I was going to tell you, but I, I was Actually, just... the whole world has known about it, you mean. Who is the father? Because it's obvious it's not the same man you claim is away on a trip. Father, 
He should be here. <clears throat> he, he's out of town for business. Yes. Yes. Okay. Well, um, what I have to do, I have to make arrangements for the money transfer into your account. And, um, that will take me just a week. Thank you, Arinzi. Hold on now. Hold on now. What is going on here? Oh, sorry, sorry ma. I tried stopping you, but you wouldn't stop. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. Oh, look at me. See my face now. I'm the one that brought her home the other time. Uh, yes, I remember you. Um, thank you again, but what is this about? I beg you. I will warn you. I will blow you just now. I beg you. I beg you. I'm sorry, I died. I did not mean to just enter your house like this, but she, 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 she gave me no choice. Mama, I'm the father of that baby. What? You know, she got my details from a sperm bank. When she called me to me, and we got to talking. Yeah. You, you visited a sperm bank. We are a sperm. Mommy, I don't, I don't know who he is. I don't know this guy. When you were lying on my bed. You are saying you 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 hate this your family and you you hate this fake lifestyle. That's enough. Stop right there, gentlemen. Do you want money? Because I can't think of an explanation for this cheap blackmail you are trying to pull off. I beg you, ma. With, with all due respect, ma, sir. I, I don't need anybody's money. I beg you. I'm, I'm, I'm a lot of things. No problem. I, I don't take a I'm, I'm not a liar. I'm get, out. get out. Mama, enough. Get out. Enough. Get out. Let this be the last time I see this low life in my premises. You will not only lose your job, but you will spend quality I'm time in prison. Man. Get out of my house! That's my baby now, Mama! Mama, I have everybody that's my baby now! That's my baby now! <laughs> I'm sorry for the rude interruption, uh, uh, Can sorry. we continue from where we left off? Sure, sure, sure. Yes. Uh, young men who will give an arm and a leg to be your husband. Don't you dare walk out on me. How dare you drag your family's name to the mud? Because I love him with all my heart, mommy, and that is something you've never felt. Everything about you is about reputation. What will people say? How will people see me? And you never loved that either. You stayed with him because he offered you financial security, not because you loved him. So don't you take this away from me.
cannot lock me into, inside this house like a wild animal. You might as well be at the moment because you're not reasoning. Downstairs and eat something. He would pick my calls. Well, you denied him. What did you expect him to do for God's sake? Huh? He would pick my calls. Um, this is Dorcas. We are friends. Um, remember you were at my office and you dropped your card. See, what do you want? Uh, why are you calling me? Listen, I'm sorry for what I did. Okay, I'm sorry for what we did. The truth is, she was expecting an inheritance and so she needed to conceive to access it. Okay, so that means she just, she just used me or I don't, that, that's, I don't understand. But, but honestly... She met you at a spam bank. What did you expect her to do? People don't find love there. It's not normal. Look, what do you want from me? See, Oya needs you. She's not eating. She's not drinking anything. She's just locked up in her room. I'm sorry, I have to find another way. Paula, please. She needs you. She really, really, really needs you. Please. If I want to be left alone, don't you understand? If my God touch you, he's going to lose his job. Your God will not do anything. Don't worry about this one. Are you okay? I really need to go. Dele keeps calling me. It's like he wants to blow up my phone. Oh, it's fine. You have done well. Thank you, dear. It's not bad. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, babe. Anything for you. You know it. <laughs> Bye for Larry. You sure? Um, uh, what about the fruits? Okay. All right. Can we go somewhere? <laughs> Where you want to go? I don't know. Anywhere that is not here. Uh, what, 
Well, where are you going? You, you can't leave my supervision. Mommy! No alcohol. Of course, of course. More often now. It suits you. As long as I see your face every day, I'll keep smiling. Ha. See lyrics. <laughs> I beg. You, you, you've never mentioned your father before. You've never asked me about my family. Well, I'm asking you now. He was a soldier, but he died, child, in the land of duty. He loved his family, but I think he loved his motherland more. So, so sorry to hear that. No, it's okay. It happened when I was young, was a long time ago. Not about your father. <clears throat> he had a heart attack. Sometimes I blame myself for it. See, I wasn't the child he wanted me to be. And if I was, possibly, maybe he would still be alive. No. Mm -mm. Can't be doing those things. No, they, they, they raised me to believe that everything happens in its own time, child. Anything that happens on this earth, we let's in a God plan out. So, just take it. It's happened that. I found you. The best gifts I could ever ask for. <laughs> Today you got lyrics, so. <laughs> Who's this now? Yo, okay. Ah. Uh. Hello? Yeah. Yeah, this is him. You don't mean it. No, 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 I'm, I'm here. I can hear, I can hear, I can hear you. So I got it. You are sure? No, I, I'll come tomorrow to pick it up. I'll come. No, no, no. Tomorrow, first thing in the morning, I'll be there. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. God bless you. See, God bless you. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow. God bless you, my God. She has called the call. Who was that? They gave me the contract. <gasps> no, serious, they gave me the contract. They gave me the contract. I don't blow. I'm going to be rich. I am so proud of you. I don't have <laughs> Your mother will be so happy. I have to call. I'll tell her when I get home, Shaka. See, I've been praying for this for. Somebody help me. I beg you, somebody help me. Uh, doctor, how is she doing? She's well. She almost had the uh, complications. Which complication? Why is everybody silence now? I was 
was diagnosed with ovarian cancer. Why would you not tell me now? Um, uh, doctor, uh, how, how is the baby? He's alive and well. Oh, thank you, God. Oh, thank you, God. Oh, I thank you. My Lord, my God, you are the Alpha and Omega. In one day, you have saved the life of my daughter and that of my grandchild. Glory be to your name, Father. Glory be to your name, Father. What does that mean? Yes, thank you, God, for this gift. It's a beautiful name. <laughs> Listen, up. I'm sorry for how I behaved earlier. Oh, please. I don't know about your sickness. I I thought you were just one sport brat who did not care about anybody. Well, I was. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, you married me. Uh, I know, uh, I know it's crazy now, and I. I've not known each other that long and I did not prepare a, a ring, but... Say something. I know I cannot see any ring, but... Yes, I'll marry you.